So as you can see, it's pretty easy to generate some basic quantities from the corridor model itself using the component quantity tool. Now let's take a look at another tool to generate some quantities, and this time we're going to use the element component quantity tool. So let's take a look at uh, computing some quantities using this element component quantities tool. So I'm going to close my civil report browser, close the component quantity dialog, and then to get to the element component quantities tool, we're going to go over to Home, and we're going to go to Civil Analysis, and we're going to go to Element Component Quantities. And this one works much the same way that the Component Quantities tool does. So we're going to come over here and select it, locate our corridor once again, right click to complete. Okay, so we have a similar dialog that appears for the element component quantities. So we have our materials listed on the left, our surface areas, our volumes, our units, unit costs, and total material costs. And the difference between element component quantities and component quantities is that the element component quantities tool computes quantities directly from the 3D elements in the corridor model. And also will produce more accurate results because of this. Now this tool also allows for quantities to be computed from clipping corridors, but it does not provide cut and fill volumes. Since cut and fill volumes are typically not closed shape components, it only reports volumes for closed shape components. So again, it works just the same way as the other tool does. If we go to the report button, we can produce a report. So when the report appears, you'll notice that we have volumes for any of our closed shape components, and we do not have volumes for cut and fill. So in our next video, we will talk about how we can produce the cut and fill volumes from the model using 3D volumes or 3D mesh elements. If you found this video helpful, please give it a like. If you want to see more such series, consider subscribing to our channel. Thank you, and see you next time.